Alright, now that you're uh, through camp and you had that scrimmage today, how did you feel in the scrimmage? Did you feel a lot more game-like? Yeah. How did you feel? Like you played? Well, um, <laughs> well, honestly, honestly, uh, I kind of, I kind of took what was lighter, lighter on the reps for me today. It was more so, you know, in some situations, a couple of yeah, other people, opportunities and stuff. But um, overall, it was still good, you know, watching and, you know, getting out there still, just moving around a little bit. Just, but you know, camp coming to a conclusion felt good. We had a great camp, and we ready to just keep going. Can't stop. So since you got to watch a little more today, what was it like watching on the sidelines with Marcus and Brian playing and obviously so much talk about the quarterback battle from your perspective on the sideline? How did they look today and what do you think of them through the camp? <laughs> man, why y'all always ask me that? Well, because we want to know. Yeah, man. You're a quarterback, so you, you, know, you, you defend Se against them. September 1st, we will all see, because I, I really don't know myself. September 1st, September 1st, but um, Jake Rodriguez looks good too. Jake Rodriguez, he's nice. Sacramento, he's from Sacramento. He's been doing his thing too. How excited are you to to know who the Steve? though you're on defense. How excited are you to know who the starting quarterback will be? Um, I mean, I figure with any of them, we're gonna be all right. But you know, offense, offense sells tickets. Defense wins championships. <laughs> but offense does. Offense wins championships too, though. Don't get it. <laughs> no, let's not get that twisted. How difficult. Was it playing against Brian and Marcus from a defensive perspective? How difficult was it playing against them throughout camp? Man, it's like, I told you, man, I just be so focused on the receivers and just, like, I really don't know who's in. Yeah. At the same time, it could be Jake Rodriguez in or Jeff Jeff Lockey. He could be in, too. So, I, at the same time, they all carry their load pretty good. But does that feel like, you know, regardless of who's in, does it feel like it's almost making you guys as a defensive unit, especially as a secondary, that much better because... You know, you're playing against... Heck yeah, all our all our quarterbacks, they all are mobile. So that forces the secondary and the whole defense to continue covering all day. So you got to just stay live. And, you know, with all our quarterbacks, that's, you know, the type of quarterbacks you need for this type of offense. And they all are pretty good. Can you explain the Cheerios? Everyone's walking out with Cheerios, General Mills, everything like that. What's going on with this? They're America's favorite. <laughs> they America's favorite. It's a little, a little, a little treat, a little treat for yourself. Which, uh, which Ben and Jerry's uh, milkshake did you go with? Uh, strawberry, strawberry banana. I think I had. All right, strawberry banana. But, but really, how many of those boxes were back there? Because I mean, everyone's walking out. Justin Hoffman had yeah. about five in his hand. He couldn't even yeah. get it to his car. Well, um, enough for everybody on the team. Enough for everybody on the team, so what, 105 probably? Put some boxes. Should've gave us some milk, too, though. How do you feel about like the progress you guys made over the last few weeks? Uh, man, we, we've been grinding, man. It's, we're, a lot of progress as a team, just uh, uniting more as a team, just being around each other, seeing it, uh, everybody every day. It's just good. It's good just bonding experience and hard work at the same time. Excited on this by the same token to start looking towards an opponent. Oh yeah, for sure, for sure. Once now, once we could put put all our everybody together and start going against other people, it's gonna be fun. So Saturday, Saturday, we fill that in all game. Soon there'll be a scout team we can go against, starting to run Arkansas State plays, things like that. Or now, are you just looking towards the first game? Well, well, to be honest, too, going against our offense is like. Even though we're going against them every day, the same thing, we're going against a great team every day, you know what I mean? So they give us good work every day, but going against another team is going to be cool. It's going to be cool. Who's the toughest guy to cover this last one? Um, they all, all the receivers are different. All of them are different, man. You got to play them all differently. Who do you like going up against the most? Um, I like going against Josh Huff. I like going against Rasan Vine, BJ Kelly. Divine black men, all of them. <laughs> Let's say so. I like everybody. Yeah, I don't discriminate on that. Everybody give me a different, something different to work on. How many interceptions do you have in camp? Uh, I really don't know. I don't know. At least a few, though, right? Yeah. For How sure. many interceptions do you want this year? Uh, man. Well, uh, I kind of just try to just keep playing in the game and just 
man, I mean, I can't, I want to just make, make, try to make plays for the team every game. So, you know, there's not a, a number I put on it. You know, I just want to go do it, just play. Any pick sixes in camp? Um, well, no, no, no. You said a lot of the younger guys are playing a lot 